Thanks, Matt. Sometimes artists don't have to see what they're creating. They just have to feel it. And that's how one Rogue Valley woman paints her pieces, each canvas a blank slate for her next vision. I've got my music on and my paintbrushes and my paints, and that's what I do. That's what Iris Lord doesn't see like most people, but her vision on the canvas is pretty clear. When I did the owl, I put the background in first, uh, the, the dark color, mm -hmm. and, and then I could actually sort of see where his eyes went mm -hmm. and his beak. And it was just sort of there on the canvas. I can't really see it, you understand. I can't visualize it, but I get this sort of vague idea that it's really there. Art has been present in Iris's life since high school, but she didn't start painting until more recently. And really started doing it after I got really sick. You know, what am I going to do when I'm laying there in bed? So I started drawing. Doctors couldn't diagnose the illness, and Iris still doesn't know what it was. She tells me life changed dramatically after that. I've always been blind in the right eye, but my left eye had a retinal detachment, and it was reattached. Mm -hmm. So my vision is 2200, and has been for years. Since 1972, to be exact. But that doesn't stop Iris from painting her vision. Some things actually, actually show up for me not like you would see it, but how I would see it. With the support of her husband, Robin, and her ever-present cat, Pixie, Iris says she's continuing one piece at a time, each project a part of who she is. It gives me something that I can do for me. Iris is on Facebook. Her page is called Iris's Palette. We're going to include a link to that on our website, kobi5.com.